at Numerian Capital, we bring you the latest stock news each day. Please like and subscribe so we can bring these articles to you each day. Thank you. Today, January 10, 2023, why is Vera stock up 8% today? A biotech hero is invigorating sentiment for Vera stock. Shares of biopharma specialist Vero are popping substantially higher on Tuesday. The company just appointed Dr. David Ho as chairman of its scientific advisory board. Vero stock is jumping 8% on Ho's expertise and acumen. One of last year's surprise hits in the biotech sphere, Vero, Nasdaq Vero, is making headlines once again today. Currently, Vero stock is up 8%. Known for its COVID-19 therapeutic and other viral acute respiratory distress syndrome-related diseases, the company just announced that Dr. David Ho will become the new chairman of Veru's scientific advisory board. As a trailblazer of infectious disease viral research and therapeutic development, Ho commands an impressive resume. According to a company press release, Ho is the founding scientific director of the Aaron Diamond AIDS Research Center and the Clyde and Helen Wu Professor of Medicine at Columbia University Irving Medical Center. On top of that, he is a member of the National Academy of Medicine and the American Academy of Arts and Sciences. As if these accomplishments weren't enough, Dr. Ho is also a fellow of the American Association for the Advancement of Science. Further, he received his doctorate degree from Harvard Medical School and has received 14 more honorary doctorates throughout his career. Vero Chairman, President and CEO Mitchell Steiner said the following about the appointment in the release. Today's appointment of Dr. Ho as Chairman of Vero's SAB illustrates our commitment to building a team of scientific experts to support our goal of developing and delivering life-saving therapies to patients with COVID-19 and other viral acute respiratory distress syndrome-related diseases. Dr. Ho's exemplary scientific contributions to the field, historically in HIV-AIDS, and more recently in COVID-19, ideally position him to help shape the clinical development strategies of our expanding infectious disease program. A biotech hero bolsters Vero stock. While companies routinely sing the praises of their key pickups, Vero securing Dr. David Ho ranks well above the usual noise. Well known beyond the biotech ecosystem, Ho will help shine a fresh spotlight on Vero stock. Perhaps most notably, Worcester Polytechnic Institute points out the following about Dr. Ho. Time magazine bestowed upon Dr. Ho the Man of the Year honor for his pioneering research and treatment of AIDS. In 2001, he was the recipient of the Presidential Medal. Dr. Ho has been at the forefront of AIDS research for 27 years, publishing more than 350 papers. In 2022, Vero stock jumped to prominence with its COVID-19 therapeutic called Sabizabulin, targeting the treatment of COVID-19 for hospitalized patients at high risk of ARDS. Sabizabulin proved relatively effective. Although some uncertainty did exist over the data, the US Food and Drug Administration noted that the underlying clinical study met its pre-specified primary endpoint of all-cause mortality at day 60. At the time of the disclosure in November, Vero stock skyrocketed 40%. Moving forward, Dr. Ho aims to leverage his expertise on infectious diseases to help with further development of Sabizabulin. He stated the following in the release. Vero has generated compelling data on Sabizabulin and COVID-19, and I am eager to collaborate with and help guide the management team regarding future development plans for Sabizabulin treatment and its potential to work against additional viral ARDS-related diseases. According to the Council on Foreign Relations, some leaders believe COVID-19 will become endemic and more predictable and manageable as a result. However, scientists still warn about the dangers of COVID. As such, Vero stock may benefit from a large addressable market. Thanks for watching. Numerian Capital News. Please come back tomorrow for another stock news update. Thank you.